Hey guys, what's up? This is Eek. Oh wait, no. Hey guys, what's up? Echo here. Today, I'm gonna be unboxing the Rocket Wushuang M. Alright, so here's the Rocket Wushuang M. I'm super excited for this cube since I've been getting into 5x5 a little bit more recently. Um, and some other uh, random cubes. The shades on this cube look really nice. They're just like the Chi shades that um, come on the Valk and the Wuchwei. So I'm a big fan so far. Um, so yeah, let's just go ahead and do some first turns. Alright, so right out of the box, it's pretty luby on the outside. I've heard that's a common thing with rocket cubes. The magnets feel really nice. On the outer layers, they're uh, nice and snappy, so I'm sure 3x3 stage is going to be pretty nice. I'm getting some lockups right now, but I think that's because there's so much lube on the outside, so I'm just going to clean it off really quick because it's getting on my hands. So yeah, um, there's not much, too much to say about this cube yet. I know it's going to be my main because my current main is this old Yushin here, which I do like, um, and I, oh shoot, well yeah, that happens sometimes. So basically this is going to be an instant main for me. It is kind of slow right now, um, and very luby on the outside like I said, so I'll probably have to break it in a little bit more, um, but for now. It's a really good cube, and I'm sure it's going to be my main. After doing a few saws on the Rocket Wushuang M, it's really speeding up, and the loop on the outside of the cube is no longer an issue. The sandy inner layers you heard in the first turns have smoothed out, and the puzzle is much more enjoyable to turn. Also, the magnets are about the same strength across the cube. Because of the stability these magnets provide, I've noticed that I can turn at much higher TPS without worrying about lockups or catches. The only thing I might change about this cube out of the box are the tensions. They come a little bit tight, and I might loosen them up to help with the corner cutting. So far, I'd recommend this cube to anyone who really wants to get into 5x5. The $50 price tag is justified by the nice setup and professional magnet installation. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. I respond to just about every message. If you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss an upload. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.